for spending the morning at a special retirement community. Yeah, all the residents are horses. Allison's helping out at the farm in Chilton. Hi, Allison. Morning. Hey, good morning. We're at Ivlo Harley Retirement Sanctuary, which is this cool farm out in Chilton where, as you said, the, the residents are horses who are going to live out their lives here. I'm with Jody and Bruce Twite, who are the owners. Good morning. Hi. Hi. So, Bruce, for people who hadn't seen our other segments, what are you all about here? Well, we, we uh, have retirement horses. We take care of them, you know, all the time. We uh, clean out the stalls three times a day. Mm -hmm. We have pretty good-sized stalls. They're 12 by 16, 12 by 13 stalls. So they're, they're nice-sized stalls. They're all matted down. Right. Uh, so these are mostly horses that either had health problems or their owners couldn't take care of them anymore? Yeah, mostly health problems, mm -hmm. you know. A lot, a lot of the, a lot of these horses, they've got just all special issues that we have to take care of. Okay. Would would in other situations they need to be put down then? Probably. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So this is a pretty special place. Then. Yeah. I mean, we we try to think of it that way. You know, mm -hmm. we've got great volunteers to help us out, and we just uh, have a lot of heart. Yeah. And Jody, we're actually standing out in the yard right now. Th is this pretty common for these guys? Who do we have here? Uh, this is Lyric. Mm -hmm. And Taffy is behind me, behind us, and Chester is her buddy. And yeah, this is what they do all day long until about 8 o'clock tonight. <laughs> <laughs> do they stay here or do they wander off? Oh no, they stay here. They stay. They'll walk down the, you know, down our dead end road a little ways, but you just call <laughs> them and they'll come back and yeah, they know, uh, they know they're loved and we have good treats and food here, right? <laughs> Are there a lot of places like this or is this pretty unique? Um, this is pretty unique. There's, there's a lot of rescues, um, but there are not many retirement places where the horses can just stay and just live out their lives. Why, why did you want to do this? Why is it so important to have a place like that? Um, horses have given a lot to people, you know, um, and I just wanted to give something back to them. And we also do it in memory of my niece, Kristen. She passed away when she was nine, <laughs> and she loved horses. So uh, she never had a chance to get her, her own horse. And um, we know that she's looking down at us and smiling that we're, we're doing this for her too yeah. so but it must be really rewarding it is it is it's rewarding and it's also hard because we know sometime someday mm -hmm. she won't be standing here and that's the hard part right so right. because bruce they're they're meant to they're going to live out their lives here right oh you bet they'll stay right here mm -hmm. yeah. how long have you guys been going now going on four years okay Okay. And I mean, obviously, it's expensive uh, to take care of horses, horses with medical needs, too. Are you going to be able to continue? Things? Yeah, I mean, we, we do our best. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, we get a lot of, you know, donations. Uh, some give us hay, others equipment, you know, uh, supplements, stuff like that. So that, that really all helps. Great. Well, thank you so much for having us Thanks. this morning. Thanks. I had such a fun time out here. <laughs> you guys, they're all just so sweet and curious and friendly. Uh, they have about, oh, more than 10 retirement horses. And, you know, people are calling them if they uh, have a horse that needs a home that, uh, you know, in other circumstances might need to be put down. So really, it's just a very special place out here in Chilton. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sounds like it. And looks like it. Thanks, Allison. Mm -hmm. Thanks, sure. Allison.